I think it's uh, a sense of excitement for everybody. Uh, the season's about to start, so uh, training camp is the start of everything. You get out there and uh, you build chemistry with your team. You, you learn the new offense, whatever coach is trying to put in right now. And so, I mean, it's the start of everything, and that's why everybody works hard in the off season for is to get back into it. There's there's been a lot of guys over the last few months that they use the word better when trying to describe this team. Now you did lose some pieces. But you're a four-time playoff team that's now better. Do you, do you agree with that? That this team is better and in better position to go deeper this year? Yeah, I agree with that. Like you said, we lost a lot of key pieces. Uh, James Johnson was a huge spark for us. Ed Davis did a good job when he came in. Uh, lost Jamal Franklin and we lost Mike Miller. We all know his uh, his shooting ability. But uh, like you said we added a couple guys. We added Vince Carter, the rookies, and everybody that's coming in. And so uh, going into the season. Being healthy is, is a key also. You know, Mark was out for a couple uh, well, a while and uh, TA was out for a little bit. So if we all start healthy, I think we can be a lot better. Having uh you being with Dave Yeager for now the second season, does that help as well with this uh try to you know, with the transition and heading into camp in the season? Yeah, for the most part, being uh being with him for another season you get a you get used to his sense of humor. You know that he likes to joke uh, joke around a lot. So when I first got here, he would say things, and I'm like, "Is he serious?" <laughs> so I, I understand him, and then he, uh, he'll probably be more comfortable now. You know, I mean, he got a year under his belt, just like with with us. And so uh, I think it'll be I think it'll be better than last year. He'd be more confident. He'd be more direct, and, and everything. Like I said, having that experience uh, help him a lot. Does getting out of town for training camp does that do anything for team bonding, or is that just a myth? Uh, I, I think so because. When you, when you get out of town, you, you leave home base. You know, some of, when we're done here in practice, some people might hang out, but everybody goes home to their own personal lives and whatnot. And so while we're out there, it would be a lot more bonding, like team dinners and stuff like that. So you'll get to spend time with your teammates. So I think it helps a lot. You mentioned the word comfortable. Are you more comfortable now? Because, again, you came at the halfway point of last season and, and, and jumped into it really well. Now you know your role. Are you more comfortable the, the second go around with this team now? I am. I am. Uh, like you said, I, I came in and uh, I was thrown in that fire right away, which I didn't have a problem with that. I enjoyed it. But uh, like I said, I'm, uh, I'm familiar with the personnel on the team now as, as far as everybody's personalities and where they like the ball and what they like to run and where they where they want me at on the floor and whatnot. So I think being here for uh, the second year will help out a lot. Is there more – is it more than just making the playoffs now for this team? I mean, you've been four, four years in a row. When I say you, I mean the team. Yeah. But – Obviously, is, is is this team now more set to do more than just make the playoffs? Is making the playoffs not enough anymore? No, it's not. Uh, we, everybody in that locker room after we lost uh, game seven last year was upset and uh, felt like that we could have won. I mean, we didn't have Zebo and, and Zebo was the main one mad in the locker room and when we got on the plane. Uh, but, yeah, just making the playoffs is, isn't good enough anymore. We want to we make the playoffs and we want to go out there and compete for a championship. So. That's our goal and that's, that's, that's going to be our focus.